Okay, this is for Kurt. This piece is uh, composed from his birth date and the date of the new year. And I'm going to show you how I use those numbers as a jumping off point, as an inspiration point, as a limitation to create music. So what I, what I usually do is I'll, I'll take a piece of sheet music and write the person's name up there. And I'll put their, the numbers that I'm dealing with. Okay, so I have those numbers in front of me. I sit down on the piano and I start working with the numbers and seeing what kind of mood I want to create. Some kind, of, you know, if it's a tango or if it's going to be whatever, you know, the form of it, the the flavor, the style. And Kurt's sister mentioned that he was a fan of Thomas Newman. So I listened to Thomas Newman and I thought, wow, that sounds great. Thomas Newman is the composer of the soundtrack to American Beauty. And I thought I could write something in that vein, something that has that flavor to it. So I sit down and I'm looking at his birth date, which is, he's got the numbers 13165. Really good numbers to base some chords on. So then I go, if I start on a, a C, that's, that's one. And then a three in a minor would be this chord. And then back to the one. And then six would be, could be that note or that note, depending on what minor I'm using. And then five. And then I go, wait a minute, that makes a great chord progression. So just the bass notes, the roots of each chord in the very first section are based on his birthday. Now, there's a lot of other stuff going on, obviously. So like I said, it's just a jumping off point. So that's where the, the art, artistry and the craftsmanship starts to overlap. So to kind of create that Thomas Newman vibe, I created this little ostinato rhythmic pattern. And then you've got these, the, the, the bass notes I'm playing right here, again, are based on his birthday. Now, there was another number, which is the new year. I wanted to kind of project a sense of coming into something new, right? And the new year is 10121. So basically, I'm going between one and two, or two ones, a two, and a one. So in this key, those notes are here's one, here's two, here's one. What can I do with those to create a sense of one is kind of like home, and then that's two on top of one, and then back. So it's kind of a little bit, you know, starting at home, going away, coming back. So I decided to, to put the ending of the piece there with those alternating chords that kind of represent the new year. And, and on top of that, I sprinkled this fairy dust theme that you'll hear that goes like this. Which again is one, one, two, one, and then one, two, one. And that you'll hear that throughout the piece. That's again the hope, the renewal of the new year coming. And that sprinkles throughout the piece. Now another thing for your theory people out there, the bridge, the B section, basically takes the chords and does what we call the negative harmony of them. So it's like a mirror image of the numbers. So when we get to the bridge, there's, it's, it's like a whole new section's arrived. Right? And then now we have a different part of the story. This is all a mirror image. And then we come back to home. Okay? So it's a bit of craftsmanship and artistry and just kind of following my the the spirit. And I hope you enjoy it. Kurt, I hope you enjoyed this explanation. Um, basically it's several piano parts. Uh, woven on top of each other. The very last part was improvised. I improvised the melody, kind of like the theme to American Beauty. I wanted to find something melodic that the ear could hold on to. So I improvised that. I <clears throat> bring in my jazz training and did, you'll hear it, a little bit of a improv. So this was a lot of fun. This was an incredible honor. And if anybody else is interested in having something like this for their family, for, it could be for a wedding, anniversary, birthday, Christmas, Valentine's Day, there's many reasons
that you can hire either Karen or I. Karen can write these. She also can write songs with words. And we have many different levels. And it's a complete honor and it's a joy to do these, to bring these to families and people. Um, I hope you enjoy it. So I'm going to go ahead and play now. Actually, I'm not going to play it because I can edit that in. It'll be better quality. So this was fun. Uh, we're in about, what, two hours now? I'm going to call it quits, and I hope to see everybody soon. Hope everybody enjoyed this.